Hello, everybody. Um, what we're going to do is uh, take a look at a talk here that I did uh, previously this year, um, how to jumpstart your career in open source. And the one thing I'm not going to talk about is pull requests. Uh, I'm not going to talk about going and coding someplace. Um, it really doesn't matter what your focus is on something like this. It's just that you want to do something to give back, right? Who here has a career in open source right now? So we're at an open source conference, and about maybe one third are saying they have a career in open source. Um, how many people are using open source? Ah, that's everybody. Big difference, eh? It's all about you. Uh, what you are doing by using open source might be because your employer says, I have to use open source. Um, but a lot of times, you're finding a reason to track in a certain direction because something interests you. Am I right? Uh, whether that is writing in French, whether that's teaching how to use a Raspberry Pi, whether that's doing something for a school project, or whether you're, ch you're changing what you want to do every week. It really doesn't matter. But you're pursuing something that interests you, and that gives you the passion and the dedication to be able to start sharing what you're doing, right? We're all teachers. Anybody that's done something for a little while become somewhat of an expert, or slowly is starting to become an expert, so share it. Talk about it, come up on stage next year and do this talk, right? It's only five minutes, come on. I think you can do five minutes, right? You can slowly approach to the point where you're doing 45 minute talks. You could also just write about it. Opensource.com would be more than happy to have you come and write about it, right? Sharing is caring, that's what we talk about, right? And when we do stuff like that, how long have you been here? Three days now, right? Three days. So have you been running around? Have you been talking to people? Have you been learning new stuff? Have you been sharing? Have you got some new ideas to go home and start trying some stuff and start sharing some stuff? This is the most important, huh? The big challenge is how long have you been working in open source? How many people here have been working in anything that's really interested them on the side for more than a year? Put your hand up. Two years, three years, four years, five. Okay, you people that five, how much of you are sharing? How many people are writing blog articles? How many people are doing meetups? How many people are just at their work doing little pizza evenings or whatever like that? Trust me, there's stuff you know a lot about that other people want to know about. You'd be surprised. Um, I've been writing in a blog for about I don't know how many years, 2007, you do the math. Um, it started basically because I got tired of searching for the solutions that I was trying to use, right? So I started documenting how I did them and put them online. Um, I, at, at Red Hat, where I work, I do quite a bit of stuff with JBoss. Uh, it's a middleware, a Java you know, tooling framework, a whole bunch of projects. One of the very simple things that I wrote a long time ago was how to serialize an object and put it in a database and how to unserialize and get it out. So serializing means you turn it into some kind of binary object and you put it in there. You think that's pretty straightforward, right? I didn't write the library, I just wrote the class to do that. Put it online, wrote the class to get it out, put it online. That is still one of my top five visited, and I mean, we're talking about code from 2007. How much code you wrote is still alive? One year, two years, three years later, right? They're still looking this stuff up. God knows why, it scares me. I hope my bank is not using that software. Anyway, this was a little preview, the three things that we talked about. Uh, it's been recorded, the slides are online. If you go to my uh, uh, Twitter account, it's Eric Chabelle, uh, one word. You can find a link to the slides, they're online. If you click on this image here, you can watch the, watch the YouTube recording of this. It was in a pretty fantastic venue. You'll, you'll get to see some of it in the recording. It was in, uh, uh, Croatia uh, in their national theater. So imagine you're standing here and you're surrounded by these golden balconies and all that stuff you see on TV when some kind of cabaret guy is doing his show. That was pretty intimidating, to be honest. But anyway, it's a really nice show. Uh, I think it's a pretty good talk, and it has nothing to do with coding, as I said. It's about you, it's about sharing, and it's about growing what you know and passing it on. Thank you.